Information and Communications Cabinet Secretary Elido Walo has stated that the government is committed to deliver its campaign promises to the people of Kenya, adding that the Nyanza economic blueprint which involves revitalization of sugar, cotton, fishing industries, mining and value addition to agricultural produce from the region form the top priority for the government. Speaking in Rarieda and Ugunja constituencies during relief food distribution that he presided over, the cabinet secretary said that the ongoing short rains that have been pounding the region in the last few days came in late when the crops had withered. We will ensure that there is adequate provision of water, electricity and roads. The government will continue with this Skong Soin irrigation project so that we are able to tap into that by way of irrigation for farming, and also for purposes of electricity. We will take electricity up to the household. Siaya County Commissioner Jim Joker stated that by December of this year, 28,000 households will be in need of relief food, a factor that is attributed to the intermittent rainfall, adding that the county may lose close to 50% of its crop harvests. Sisi hapa Siaya, short rains tumekua tukipokea, lakini naonekana Haita, haita tosha eh, kwa kishia kwamba mimea yetu itakuwa sawa sawa. Kwa hivyo, ikifika mwezi wa December, tunaone ya kwamba tutakuwa na watu 28,000 households that will require relief food support. Taya county. Kwa hivyo, as we proceed, hata sisi tutataka kuomba tuwekwa kwa mpako of receiving relief food on a regular time basis. Kwa sababu ya ile mimea iko, tunaona we may lose close to 50% of our crop to the drought. But we thank God for the continued drinks to the drought together. Owalo added that the President William Ruto-led government was willing to work with all leaders to improve the well-being of Kenyans. Owalo, who was flanked by, among others, Ugunja Member of Parliament David Ocheng, said that the Kenya Kwanza government will facilitate a major irrigation project along the Yala Swamp in Siaya to boost food security. We are willing to work with all leaders at the county government based on the level of cooperation that is prerequisite within the two levels of government. We will also work with all elected leaders and also non-elected leaders on issues of the economy so that we can help our people. In this region, CIA, we are going to ensure that the Hutos government will facilitate a major irrigation program along the Alaswam. The CS further said that the government will facilitate optimum exploitation of the fishing resources by establishing fishing processing plants along the Lake Victoria beaches. Samson Jura. For Ibro News, Nairobi.